Yo, what is good, y'all? Yo? It's your boy Ty back here with another video. And in this video today, we are going to be doing new mystery pink diamond Darius Miles gameplay, guys. I'm a big, big fan of Darius Miles, of what he can bring to your squad, stat wise, badge wise. The only thing really left to discover is is his game really like that how does he feel in game in a gameplay type setting and that's what i'm here to bring you guys today look at it darius here six foot nine 210 pounds before we dive into the stats if you are new to my channel and have not yet please consider smashing that subscribe button as we're on the road to 60,000 subscribers 89 three ball for darius 97 driving dunk yes he will dunk on everybody 86 ball handle 86 block 88 steal 90 perimeter 86 interior 80 rebounder 80 rebounding across the board 94 speed 94 lateral quickness tendency wise 100 driving dunk tendency 100 flashy dunk tendency as well great tendencies across the board 31 hall of fame badges catch and shoot corner specialist rebound or relentless finisher rim protector pick dodger chase artist clamps heart crusher deceptor intimidator post move lockdown Tyler's defender, consistent finisher, contact finisher, pro touch, Hall of Fame, showtime, quick first step tie handles, unpluckable hot zone hunter, gold badges including ankle breaker, lob city finisher, dimer, pick pocket, does have moving truck, bailout, handles for days, space grader, stop and go, green machine, hot start, rain extender, slippery off ball, tire shooter, volume shooter, as well as the gold brick wall. Badges he doesn't have, you might look to give him rebound chaser, box worm, those types of badges that I definitely give him flexible. As well as if you are next gen, definitely put that blinders badge on him. The one thing about Darius Miles that you can't take away from him is his length. Like at six foot nine with his player model, it's pretty ridiculous. Just the way he kind of can move and groove, guys. And honestly, with the Curry escape, he's looking pretty good. He might, he might, he might be looking like the best so far in just a couple, in just a couple moves, guys. Like the fact that he's 6'9, can play shooting guard. He doesn't weigh enough in which he can't do the Curry escape. And it, that release doesn't look bad. The upper is kind of messed up. But the base at least looks super, super quick. And it doesn't look that bad. Like, uh, I know a lot of people, like, uh, it kind of reminds me of Jump Shot 4. Like, a lot of people might say, oh, it looks disgusting. It's not. Trust me when I say this release is not disgusting. It is super, super quick, and I'm just going to have to get used to that timing. But it's not bad. Like, the release timing on it is super, super quick. It's going to be easy to time, too, I feel like. Especially, like, off a of peak, like, it's not bad at all. Now, the only thing for Darius Miles that i'm kind of hesitant about are his lack of hot spots from above the bur uh, from a, from above the break you guys can see no hot spots from anywhere outside the corners which does hurt his kind of value just that little bit as far as shooting wise guys he's not going to be that's not going to be his best attribute anyways right he's going to be able to knock down shots no doubt about it with his shooting badges once you do give him flexible but and that's not what he's going to be best at he's going to be best at attacking the rim dunking on top of people but again this release is not bad at all it's super quick decently easy to time now i'm slightly late when i miss with him more than more than slightly uh than, or i'm <clears throat> yeah i'm slightly late more than i am slightly early now i'm shooting some slightly earlies but definitely is going to take a little bit of getting used to the release wheel but going to the rim attacking the rim guys he is going to be maybe the best look at darius miles on next gen here we're just going to kind of see how he moves we saw in current gen how great he was even on next gen guys uh, coming up the court he's not that great but you guys got to realize the at six foot nine again he is going to be able to move and groove in the in the half court type setting i feel like on current gen he moves a lot better but maybe that's just a me effect maybe i just move better on on next gen uh, or on current gen in in specific compared to next gen but next gen release again just super quick like that's the one thing about it is current gen next gen no doubt about it this release is super quick i say on next gen it looks kind of weird now maybe that's me but it just looks kind of weird to me at least on next gen right now and i'm shooting a, a decent amount of slightly earlies on on next gen i do feel like there was a moving but I, I gotta figure out this release timing because next gen it just feels kind of weird for me it's not bad necessarily i don't think there's a bad release on next gen but it just feels kind of interesting, kind of weird to me. And it's definitely just something that's, if I use, you know, a lot of it, it's just going to take some getting used to. That's just part of it. But he's pretty knocked down. There's no doubt about it. And the best, the one thing I like about him is the fact that he's 6'9 and has the Curry escape. I absolutely love that about Darius Miles. The one thing is, can he green consistently? That's ultimately what it's going to come down to on the offensive end. Because attacking the rim, we know how Darius is going to be. Looking at our opponent here for Darius Miles, he's got one. Carlos Navarro, Kawhi Leonard, Andre Kirilenko, Giannis, and Dirop. So he's got a very, very solid lineup. 
Thinking about putting Darius Miles on Juan just to see how he can compete on the defensive end. It's going to be interesting. I feel like this guy I'm playing is pretty solid. I feel like he knows what he's doing, obviously, with his lineup he does. But it's just going to be interesting to see Darius Miles in this type of a setting, right? This guy is obviously pretty solid. He knows what he's doing. Um, so, you know, how is Darius Miles going to compete in this type of a setting? I should have just shot it with Luka. Okay, that's fine. Let's see what Darius is about. Okay. <laughs> what in the world was that? Look, I don't know what just happened. Tried Curry escaping, but Darius wanted... Darius had other ideas. I really just tried to Curry escape there, but Darius wanted to take off from the three-point line. So, hey, man, Darius, do what you got to do, my boy. That's a lightly. I love it, Darius. I love the length. Yup, get it to him. Imagine Kawhi... He should not be able to stop you. Oh, yeah, that's our board. You know what to do with it, Darius. Six foot nine... Already on display. That's fine. You want to put your secondary defense, or you want to put Juan on my secondary ball handler? Hey, man, do your thing. Juan can't guard Darius Miles. I promise you that. He's not going to be able to guard him consistently, so that's fine. Back to him. Back to Kevin. What in the world? All right, all right, let's just relax. Come here. Like, that's what I'm saying. A lot of people, when I do gameplays or anything, they just, people have started stepping so high on screens. The one thing I can say is his Juan Carlos Navarro has done absolutely nothing. Like, he has been a complete non-factor. And so that's the one thing about it. Oh my goodness, I got to agree with you, Anton. That's the one thing about it. Defensively, Darius has been elite. Offensively, he's been solid. I can't really be mad at what he's given me offensively either. Thank you, board. Y'all want to rebound, thankfully. Thank you, up to Darius. Come on. Like, thank you, ref. I was going to say, I got hacked. Let's see what, you, what the free throw release is like. Okay, knockdown free throw release. I like it, Darius. I should green the majority of these free throws green. Thank you. There you go. I mean, objectively, he's playing well. My team isn't up by much, but he's playing well. Like, I know he's in a box, but come on, man. What What is the defense? Like, what is your defense? I don't know. I'm, I'm stunned right now. Literally so boxed. Literally so boxed. Look at Darius. Can you just back up? Oh, yeah, Darius. There's no way Juan got that type of a contest. I don't know what it is, but they know how to play, man. Like, they really do. Come on, Darius. Give me one. That's such a quick jump shot. Like, I don't know how I'm ever going to be able to time that because it is so, so quick. Look at the halftime box score for Darius Miles. 11 points, 1 rebound, 3 assists, and 1 block. So a pretty good first half all the way around for Darius. We'll see what he can do in this second half. It's fine. It's Ben Simmons. I'm not too worried about that. Go grab a board. Oh, yeah, Darius. I need it. Come on, man. I need a board. Come on. Uh-oh. I knew... I knew he was going to do that. I knew it, man. He was going to overreact to the wide-open three-point shooter. And we'll take the easy showtime dunk because of it. Yes, sir, Darius. Yes, sir, Darius. Come on, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, man. I got to green it. That's me, man. That's me. My fault. Wide open. I guess. I mean, if you're going to leave me wide open, it's too easy. Literally too easy. Come on. He might want to get it out of his hands. I was lurking too. Yeah. Like, that's what I'm saying. Just look at the defensive impact Darius has had right now. Oh, my goodness. I'm not going to sit here and, and gas it. Like, he is pretty solid. He definitely is. He knows how to play the game. Knows what he's doing. So, come here, Darius. Oh, yeah. I'm going to say, Tyler Hero is a baby in there. He shouldn't be able to defend you, Darius. Oh, yeah, Darius, that's a good little pull-up from the mid-range area. That's not really what I wanted, but I'll take it. That's a great shot. That's such a tough look. I mean, if you hit it, you hit it. It's tough, though. Oh, my goodness. Just back up, my boy. Oh, my goodness, Darius. I got to just let it go. I just got to let it go a little bit earlier because right now, I'm not greening anything.
a great possession. Back to Mikhail for a green light. Long to... And I mean, Darius Miles attacking the rim. Look at how many fouls he's drawn. We're fine. Stay home. Stay solid. We're good. Thank you, board. Thank you, Ron. Up to Darius. Showtime, me, Darius. Do not get blocked. Thank you. The Showtime Slam. Darius Miles is hooping for me right now. He definitely is. That should be mine, right? Thank you. I should have made a read on that, for, uh, on that prior possession just one second earlier, honestly. Go buy him, bro. Put him in the rim. And one, I was going to say, come on, ref. But that's not what he wants to do. Like, although, it, you know, it worked for him, he doesn't want to sit there and have to do that with Juan on a consistent basis. I just got to shoot it, man. I just got to be more confident with Darius. Oh, my goodness. You put it down. Five seconds. Come on. Y'all can get me a bucket. Just don't throw it away. Come on, Twan. Come on, Twan. Give me one. Good shot. I need it. Come on. That's a big time bucket. Oh, man. I don't know what it's going to take, but I need to just go on a little bit of a run here. That's too close. Give me one, Darius. That's a good release. That's got to be green, 2K. Look, I don't know why it wasn't green, but that's as good as release as I can put on it. They let you hit that? Come on, Darius. You're a dog. Like, you got 31. You've been hooping. Put him in the rim. And you get blocked by Juan Carlo, bro. Silence him. Come on, man. Come on, Darius. Be that dog, then. Silence him all. Me, me. <laughs> Thank you, Darius. Keep hooping, man. You're literally carrying me. Just keep hooping. You're sitting. Good stuff. Come on. Thank you. Run. Run. Come on. Come on, Darius. Come on, Darius. Come on, Darius. Come on, Darius. Hope for me then. Come on, man. This dude is tough. I don't, I don't know what else there is to say. This dude I'm playing is definitely tough. That's not green. I know I need to go on a little run at some point, but I don't know how. I don't know how that's going to happen. Like, Darius has been hooping, but I don't know how I'm going to go on a run. He's got 40, man. He's literally got 40. Thank you. Come on. Come on, Darius. That's not green? I don't understand how. I'm slightly late, and I'm barely even holding it down. Like, good thing you're hitting your whites today. You're hooping. What just happened? Yes, sir, Darius. Come on, man. You're hooping right now. Yep, we're going five out. And, and, and I want to see who's going to help. Because I know Juan can't guard you straight up. I know he can't guard you straight up. I know he can't guard you straight up. So... I need to see who's going to come over and help side next possession. Chill. We need a reset, though. Back to him. Like, he just attacking the rim is a menace. Like, he really, truly is. Yeah, where are we going with it? 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 Darius Thank is sitting. You. Yep. Look at Darius, man. Look at Darius. Go crazy then, my boy. You got to foul me. Is Darius going to get to 50? That's, that's the only question I got now, right? Is he going to get to that 50-point mark? Because so far this game, he's done basically all I could have asked. Offensively, defensively, everything. Oh, yeah. 
He's a minute defeat. He's not going to get to 50. 49 points for Darius Miles. And in that second half, he came up big. He got me some stops on one. Did just enough to put me over the edge to get an 83-76 to 76 victory. Look at the final box score, guys. What more could you want? 49 points, 2 rebounds, 6 assists, 1 steal, 1 block. I guess he did have the 3 turnovers. Was 5 of 6 from 3, and I don't even think I greened any of them. 17 of 22 overall from the field, 10 of 10 from the free throw line, responsible for 63 out of my total 70 or out of my total 83 points. Overall, guys, I'm a huge fan of Pink Diamond Darius Miles. And when I say a huge fan, no, I mean it. Like, I'm a big, big fan of Darius Miles. You compare him to Kawhi Leonard, I think it's a pretty decent comparison. I really do. Offensively, defensively, I think it's a fair enough comparison. Now, what does Darius Miles give you over Kawhi Leonard? I think offensively, especially like handling the ball, he might just give you a little bit more, especially attacking the rim. Kawhi obviously defensively is still going to just have those few extra badges. So when it comes down to it, I'm still thinking Kawhi Leonard's probably better. Although badge wise, give me Darius Miles' badges. When it comes down to it, guys, it's all really truly preference. I just think Kawhi Leonard just is a little bit better still. But still, for whatever Darius Miles goes for, I'm guessing he's going to be right around 40k right now. He is an absolute beast for that price. I really do believe that when you compare him so even a guy like Malik Seeley, I think Darius Miles gives you just a little bit more. Now, that's my opinion, my takeaway from it. Uh, and guys, like I said, for 60K is what he's going for right now. That might be a little too much, but if you can get him for, you know, the 50K price range, that's not the worst price for Pink Diamond Darius Miles. It really, truly isn't because this card is very very solid but that is going to wrap it up for my pink diamond darius miles gameplay guys let me know what your thoughts are on the card down below in the comments i think he is pretty pretty stellar and can play in any type of environment whether you are a no money spent player whether you're looking for a player for a competitive type game drop a like on the video subscribe if you are new and as always man i love you guys and have a blessed day